reproductive immunology is the um, specialism of medicine which understands the immunology behind the conception and pregnancy. Um, the nature has been very clever and it's still intriguing to us as to how a human body accepts the pregnancy without rejecting it. While it is constantly, the immune system is fighting infections like bacterial infections, viral infections, or even the transplanted organs which are not tissue matched will be immediately be rejected by the body. However, in case of pregnancy, for some reason, the body has been uniquely modified so there is a theory or a hypothesis that the immune system tends to get modulated during pregnancy, whether it has been blunted or whether it has been suppressed or modified. For some reason, the body continues to accept the pregnancy and carry on. What is important to remember is this is a new science. There's still very controversial when we talk mainly in context of the fertility treatments. There are many studies which have been supporting, but equally the same number of studies have been uh, refuting the support for this. However, there is a current early thinking, and in keeping with the current early thinking at London IVF and Genetics Centre, we believe that there is a role for such interventions and such treatments in a select group of patients, examples being previous IVF failure or repeated treatment failures or repeated miscarriages. So we do believe there is no routine role for such interventions, but there is a role in a select group of patients. Obviously, we also want to contribute to the science and evolve and see how it develops. So reproductive immunology is of relevance only to a select group of patients, primarily with recurrent implantation failure.